Alexis Nubia here. We are here for another video. We are discussing urinary tract infections. I recently contracted one of these for the first time and it kind of freaked me out. This video is going to be telling you how I treated my urinary tract infection naturally. I'm more of like a holistic, natural, I'm more on that path of healing so if you resonate with me and you really care about what you put in your body my video is definitely for you i don't know exactly how i got the urinary tract infection i just know i got it around christmas time and around that time i was going to the mall often to shop and i was using public restrooms more i just figured i got it because of that i got a uti and ended up going to my doctor and um taking a test taking a urine test i did a um test on my own so i went ended up going to healthy planet and they they were selling these strips where you can pee on it and it'll detect if you have a urinary urinary tract infection or not so i was able to detect through my doctor and through the strips and it came back positive. I just was not into taking the antibiotics. Antibiotics do have an effect on your body, um, short term and could it be long term. I just figured I would go the natural route, which is the route I normally take. And yeah, so I'm gonna get into all of that shortly in the video, okay? What is a UTI? UTI is short for urinary tract infection. A urinary tract infection is an infection that can affect your urinary system. Your urinary system would include your bladder, your kidneys, and your urethra. Bacteria or fungus can get into your urine and travel up um, your urinary system all the way up to your bladder. UTIs normally cause more than about like 8 million trips to healthcare providers every single year. And women are at greater risk of contracting UTIs than our male counterparts. So let's get into the symptoms. When you feel like a pinching, burning sensation, you need to go to the bathroom a lot. You have like a white cloudy substance in your urine. Like you can have pain in like your lower stomach area or pelvis area. You can have pain in your mid back um, where your kidneys are. If you have a strong urge to pee, did I say that already? And even like a strong smell, those are some of the symptoms of a UTI. When you go to the doctor, the doctor will kind of like diagnose like you from the symptoms that you have and they will basically prescribe antibiotics to deal with the bacteria or the fungus which is causing the uti well, antibiotics are basically a type of antimicrobial did i say that right antimicrobial substance that basically helps fight in um infections antibiotics are known to either kill or inhibit growth of bacteria i still have the antibiotics here didn't open it or anything. He prescribed me 28 tablets of Sulfatrim. I believe that's the name of it. There's another long name, but I'm not gonna get into that. If you hear like random noises, it's my cat. Ma'am, could you get out? Say hello to Isis, she's making trouble. Go, let's put Isis away. <laughs> Where was I? It is more common for women to get reoccurring infections and i believe this to be so because once you put um a woman on antibiotics the antibiotics have the possibility to just like wipe out all your bacteria right and we need some good bacteria to be able to function and yeah so that's kind of like the cons to antibiotics it's just like you have to be able to replace your good bacteria. Women can get reoccurring infections because our urethras are very close to our, you know, vagina, our vagina opening. 
and our anus so you know things can crawl up there because <laughs> it's closer you know and our urethras are shorter versus men so you know i don't know maybe your bacteria or fungus can climb up there or has easier access or something you can get utis by holding your pee by just being uncleanly you can get utis during sex the bacteria just traveling everywhere you can get utis just like that using antibiotics like i said before can cause recurring infections your body can become antibiotic resistant we don't want our bodies to become resistant to the antibiotics and like being able to get these recurring infections it's annoying and it is like it disturbs our like daily life like who wants to be you know doing this like stuff all the time and like going through infections and feeling burning and like you know what i mean like no one wants to be going through that all the time so for me the natural route is just the best route for me because i'd rather be taking something that's of the earth or, or like less synthetic that won't harm my body in a negative or bad way you don't want to be like depending on the antibiotics because you don't want to disrupt your natural bacteria your good bacteria you don't want to go through weird side effects when it comes to like taking prescription medication and things like that of the sort um, let's get into the herbs and supplements that i used to heal my uti naturally okay first i'm gonna say i'm gonna say make sure you go to the doctor i go to the doctor normally to get diagnosed just to get like a medical professional's view and then i kind of like make a healing um you know prescription of my own if you get me it depends on what i'm experiencing we all do things differently i went straight to the like natural health store i was like yeah no like we're gonna we're gonna get rid of this we're not doing um antibiotics sorry sorry <laughs> we're not doing it honey thing i want to know is that doing things a natural way sometimes it takes a little bit longer to heal it just depends on the severity of things it could take from like you know couple days to a few weeks depending but well, that's something i also want to note i went to the um natural food store and got these items specifically i'm going to start with the herbs well first and foremost you need to drink a lot of water if you have a uti drinking a lot of water is going to be really really effective because you need to flush all the bacteria and fungus out of your um urinary tract okay um, so water therapy, we're drinking lots of water during this time. Don't skip out on the water. Like you got to pee anyways, you got to let it all out. So you got to drink a lot of water. Okay. We're going to take herbs and supplements that help remove the bacteria and the infection, help you like pee more. We're going to take things that are kind of like a natural antibiotic. Okay. So let's get into it. I drink tea every day, once or twice a day. So it was no problem for me to make these teas. So I was using corn silk and I was using uva ursi. I was mixing these two together and I was making a tea every single day, once or twice a day. So that you can get corn silk in a um, like tea bag form. And this is from Celebration Herbals. I got this from Healthy Planet. This I got from like my health food store that I normally go to. I'm gonna show you what corn silk and uversi looks like, and then I'm gonna explain the benefits um, to you. So this is how corn silk looks. It's like brownish, reddish, mahogany-ish, and it's like, like, looks like hay or string, like, I guess silk maybe. And this is Uva Ursi. I don't know if I'm saying that correctly. This is how it looks. Let me show you. It looks like that. And you put that together and you, you know, you just boil it for like, I think I boiled it for like 10 minutes. And then I kind of let it sit and steep for a bit. 
um and it's not bad tasting actually it's actually a mild taste it's actually really nice let's get into the benefits i'm gonna read this from my book because i wrote notes down uva ursi is antiseptic it's a natural antibiotic it reduces the infection and it also cleanses the kidneys corn silk is great for bladder infections an inflamed urinary system it encourages urination okay and it's a, it's a diuretic it's normally used in traditional chinese medicine so uva ursi corn silk together as a tea is what i did if you are prone to recurrent utis make this tea on a regular basis you'll you'll see a dramatic difference okay let's get into the supplements that i used let's start with a th cranberry um pills i use a lot of cranberry this isn't the one i used though this is just like kind of like what i bought after the other one finished the first one i used i used like i think what it like a uti cranberry pack or something like that I don't know if you guys are familiar with that one but i'm gonna like drop a picture in like right now and probably a link um to find it i got it at healthy planet it says like urinary tract health like on there it's good for that another supplement that i use is my probiotics and i use the genuine health probiotics for women advanced gut health probiotic this cat I use probiotics on a regular basis so this is just something I don't use probiotics every single day like pill form or supplement form on a regular basis but during the time when I had the bacterial infection I used it every single day okay because I was not playing I also used um D Manos D Manos is amazing <laughs> for UTIs. This one specifically is D Manos with cranberry. So like I said, I was not playing. It is used in herbal medicine to prevent recurrent urinary tract infections. Provides antibiotics for the maintenance of good health. Okay, we're gonna get into the benefits of these um, supplements shortly. I also used golden seal tincture, okay? If you know, now you know, sis, okay? Golden seal tincture, okay? This is a bitter tonic. We need bitters in our life. We need bitter tonics in our life. We need for wash out, <laughs> okay? So I'm gonna get into the benefits of all these. Let's open up back our handy dandy notebook. Let's get into the a cranberry, right? Like, we all know that cranberry is amazing for UTIs. Um, it prevents bacteria from sticking on the bladder. It helps reduce the UTIs and prevents it. So cranberry is like definitely the go of like UTIs. Like everybody knows like when you get something like that, like cranberry, 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 okay? Probiotics help restore and maintain healthy bacteria. And it ensures bad bacteria have a less opportunity to survive probiotics are amazing like overall they're amazing golden seal like i said it's a, a bitter tonic it's also an internal antibiotic you're going to have that antibiotic effect when you take the golden seal especially for the uterine and the vaginal area it will tone things out there and clean things out there right so golden seal is definitely 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 something you, you want to have um i don't like not a lot of people talk about golden seal like that but i'm going to talk about it because it's actually really good i would fill my water cup like i have a water cup like about like this big it looks like a stanley cup i'll fill my water cup and i would put enough of golden seal um that i would need to take for the day in the cup and like drink the cup for the day golden seal probiotics cranberry d manos oh, let's get into d manos so d manos is a type of simple sugar that attaches to bacteria and removes it from the system along with d manos okay 
you got cranberry that prevents it from sticking to the bladder. But then we have something like D-mannose that attaches to the bacteria and removes, helps remove from the system. And then we got the water therapy that we're taking a lot of water, we're taking a lot of liquids to kind of remove and flush. And then we got the corn silk, which is encouraging your ur urination. Okay, so all of these things are just amazing. Okay, so yeah. Okay, one more thing. One more thing. I would also add oregano oil. Why oregano oil? Let me go get oregano oil. I think I have some. Oregano oil is antifungal. It is antibacterial. It's antiviral. UTIs are caused by bacteria, fungus. Having something that is antibacterial and antifungal in that regimen is definitely going to help you recover from UTIs or recurring UTIs. So let's go back down the list, okay? <laughs> I know it was a lot to take in, but trust me, once you um, get all these things and you, you know what I mean, you take all these things in, you do some research, you read and you see what's best for you, you won't regret it, okay? So we have the Uva Ursi and the corn silk tea. Then we have our cranberry, we have our D-mannose, we have our probiotics. Then we have our oregano oil and we have our golden seal. So if you want to heal your UTIs or recurring UTIs naturally, I highly, highly, highly suggest everything that I mentioned in this video. You can either go get everything or go get some things but I recommend everything because it's good to have everything, you know? Like, this might not work for you or this might work for you, it depends. Also, I wanted to say with the D-mannose, I did say it was a simple sugar. Um, so anybody that has problems with sugar, don't worry about it because it doesn't raise your sugar levels, okay? That's something important that you should know. I am like 99.8% sure that all or most of these products are gonna work for you. Especially like the D-mannose, the Uva Ursi, the corn silk, and the cranberry. Those are definitely going to work for you. If this is something that you are more interested in and healing yourself naturally, I suggest you go grab those things. And let me know in the comments how it works for you. Also, let me know if there's any other natural remedies that you know of um, that's good for healing um, UTIs. Thank you for watching my video. Thank you for being here with me today. I appreciate it so, so much. And I hope this video helps. I can't, like, I hope this video helps you guys, my fellow goddesses and queens out there. Follow me on my social. Don't forget to subscribe to this video. Like this video. Peace. Bye.